It's graduation day at Pacifica High School in Oxnard. In fact, all of the high schools in the Oxnard High School Union District are allowed to have in-person graduation ceremonies, and as News Channel 3's Senator De Los Santos explains, many folks were not expecting it. I'm so thankful for the experience that you gave me here at Pacifica High School. Destiny Marquez addressed Principal Ted Lawrence one last time Tuesday. Marquez is one of nearly 700 Pacifica High School seniors celebrating graduation day in a live ceremony. It's a bittersweet moment, so I want to cry, but I want to get up and go party and have fun. But it's been a year, so I'm really excited for this. Like many schools across the state, Pacifica's in-person ceremony was up in the air because of the pandemic. For most of the senior class, graduation day will be the first and last time they're all together. Once I heard our principal Lawrence um, announced that we are going to have our graduation ceremony, it was probably the best moment for all of us in our state because we haven't seen each other at this moment. So this is like our first day of senior year, kind of. I love these kids and being able to honor them through a live ceremony, which we thought was never, ever going to happen, even as recent as two months ago. All 10 campuses in the Oxnard Union High School District were allowed to have a live in-person graduation. Pacifica's happened to land on the same day as California's reopening. Since we're a public educational institution, we still follow Cal OSHA guidelines, which are stricter than Governor Newsom's guidelines. So we did have all of our graduates uh, engage in COVID testing prior to the ceremony. They will still wear their masks. For Marquez, it might not have been the senior year she had envisioned, but it is one she will never forget. It is surreal. I can't believe I'm standing here at this moment. In Oxnard, Senator Los Santos, News Channel 3.